Prompt and thorough treatment of soldering iron protects the working surface of soldering bits from premature wear. It also makes the tool life longer and ultimately helps maintain a high level of soldering quality. Let's consider several methods of cleaning tools. The mechanical method, wet and dry cleaning, and the chemical method, using reactuators. For wet cleaning, use a damp sponge that can be included in the package of porches separately. Sponges are usually made of viscose or cellulose. A sponge has two main functions. It removes oxides from the surface of a bit and removes the excess solder from its tip. This ensures the long life of the tool. This sponge provides better cleaning than certain sponges. It contains no corrosive substances, so it doesn't require using water. Thus, the soldering tip temperature does not decrease and the tool does not need extra time to restore heat. The chip material density is lower than that of the soldering bead coating, but higher than that of the oxides on the tool surface. Therefore, for oxide removal, it is enough to immerse the soldering bead into the chips. For chemical reactivation, we apply the BS2 paste. It is designed for quick and efficient cleaning of soldering beads from oxidation products and tinning. The paste is applied with the beads can no longer be cleaned using chips and napkins or are tinned with tubular solder. The paste consists of ammonium and phosphate for fine tin powder and binders. The optimum bead temperature should be at least 300 Celsius. We remove excess with a damp cellular sponge. Now the soldering iron is ready for further use.